Yeah, this book is from National Graphic Kids. It's opposite. Big. The orca whale is big. The goldfish is little. This is a mother polar bear with her cubs. Soft. The cotton candy is soft. The lollipop is hard. It's playtime. Can you find which toy is soft? Which toy is hard? Black. This puppy is black. This puppy is white. These sheep are eating grass. Can you find the black sheep? Hot. This coca is hot. Cold. This popsicle is cold. Kids are having fun at the beach. Can you find which things are cold? Outside. Clothes are outside the basket. Clothes are inside the basket. We sleep and play in the bedroom. Can you find which things are inside of the shelf? Which things are outside of the shelf? Can you find some opposite things? Cold, little, hard, white, outside, The end. This book is National Geographic Kids, same and different. Which one is different? Where does the crayon belong? Which penguin is different? Which group would the penguin play with? I guess he can play with either, right? <laughs> Which leaf is different? Which tree did this leaf fall from? Which fish is different? Which group should this fish follow?
Which pair of socks is different? Put this sock back. Wow, this two picture, can you find five differences? Hi everyone. After we read our books, we're going to start drawing your own opposite things. I'm going to use a black marker. I'm going to start with my left hand and my right hand. So I want to trace my, if you're right-handed, you can use, hold your hand, hold your marker with your right hand and trace your left hand. Go around, 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 and around. You can hold your marker like this, however you want. And this is my left hand. I want to do the back of my left hand. What do you see on the back of my left hand? I see fingernails. What shape are your fingernails? I just do circles. Although my fingernails is kind of like squarish, round, like, yeah. <laughs> this is the back and I also see the joint. I have some wrinkles, some lines on my joint. So that's why I can bend my fingers. You can see the lines. Look very carefully about uh, what is on your hand. I also have joint here, knuckles. You don't have to draw this much detail. So I just wanted you to be able to see all the details. I have veins inside of my hand. I can see blood, right? That's my blood, my vein inside of my hand. This is my left hand and this is the back of my left hand. Now I'm going to trace my right hand. This time I'm going to trace the inside of my right hand. I'm going to use my left hand to trace my right fingers and thumb and palm. And I wanna draw the inside of the lines on my right hand. I see <laughs> some of the lines, my I see many, many lines on my inside of my right hand. Yeah. This is left, right, back, and inside. That would be like my palm, the inside of my hand, and then the back of my hand. Okay, we read the book earlier, opposite. Something big, something small. Can you draw something really big? Can you draw something small? I don't think I'm going to draw, it's your turn. Oh, <laughs> soft and hard. I'm going to draw the cotton candy. I'm going to use a kind of like a magenta. I want to hold a soft cotton candy on my left hand. Maybe I do some little lines to show it how fluffy it is. <laughs> and I want to draw a hard lollipop. 
my I'm holding a lollipop inside of my hand. I'm using two colors together and then trying to draw swirls. I'm holding the lollipop inside of my right hand and I'm holding the soft cotton candy. The cotton candy is outside of my hand. The cotton candy is soft, lollipop is hard. I'm giving my lollipop a little bit more texture. Have you ever eat lollipop or cotton candy before? I want you to get a, a pack of cotton candy the other day at Target, but there was no the barcode. I can't scan it, so I cannot buy it. I asked the the helper, like the people who work in the market, but she, she feels like she wasn't willing to help me. So I didn't get the cotton candy. Okay, so can you think of something? Um, oh, remember we when we did the the monster? I'm going to do a black. This one has the black sheep and the white sheep. So I think I'm going to do a black sheep. <laughs> oh, white. How do we do a white? I'm going to use yellow for white. The yellow sheep. Yellow, uh, white also can be grayish, right? The, so there's no like, nothing is pure white. Color is all about which color you put next to it. Well, we can do like some, a dark color and a light color. A dark black can be some dark, like the color can be described as dark. And the yellow, pink, right, is lighter. Yeah. What is something really big? I think I just want to draw a really big bubble, how about? I draw a big bubble around my left hand and I draw some small bubbles around my right hand. And my left hand is inside of this big bubble. Inside. And the small bubbles are outside of my right hand. You can draw, now it's your turn, if you like hot chocolate, you can draw hot chocolate. You can draw cold lollipop. Oh, popsicle, icicle. Yeah, we did something is inside and then we did things outside. Okay, so now is your turn. You can draw anything that you want to, big or small, hot or cold, soft or hard. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. See you next time.